Because they're all fucking stupid. It's just like I don't. It's like I don't get this. It's like and maybe it's because I missed it, but like even in the context I already have, this is all stupid. You know, yeah. it's like it's like the Grey's Anatomy problem. In Grey's Anatomy, by the way, the stupid fucking final season, final ish season that they have on Netflix, garbage. It's I know it's all garbage in general, but like <laughs> the fucking every single problem everyone has is all on them. This is the the entire thing I've said about the show. They are the worst people on TV. Like the actors, they're all terrible. They're all fucking horrible people. They make the exact uh, wrong decision yeah. for their life. Like, here's the decision that's going to make your life perfect. You'll be happy. You'll never have an issue again. I'm going 180 degrees the other fucking way because fuck you. I don't need to be happy with my life. That's exactly what the show is now. Every fucking decision is the wrong one until it becomes a medical thing. And once the medical stuff is all solved, we're miracle workers here. And then they're still yeah. sucking the dick of Meredith Grey on it because, like, she's still like, oh, she's still Meredith Grey. It's like, it doesn't fucking matter. She should have been dead fucking four seasons ago and should have moved on to another fucking character. Like, God damn it, man. I hate this show so much. It's like, it should have ended 10 years ago. That's why I don't even bother watching these medical shows anymore. I mean, like, actual, this is what we, we argued earlier, House, superior medical yeah. drama. And it went out yep. on a high. It really did. Oh, it did. It did. Like, Grey's Anatomy, like ER hung on too long and they started sucking. Like the last three seasons of ER were kind of crap. Even though I like some of the characters. Er. It's Er. Okay. Er. Oh, okay. Hold on. It's E dot R dot. (laughs) Nope. They never actually had the dots there. Yeah, they did. No, they didn't. I just just remember Big Giant ER. Hold on. They didn't remember just ER. Hold on. I'm going to go look real quick. I I could be wrong, but I don't remember it. No, Ricky, you're not wrong. Hold on. That's why I always argued with everybody that it's not ER. It's ER because they didn't. Well, no, it is ER, but there was just no dots. I'm looking. Yeah, well, then it's not. Then it's ER. I'm looking. The dots are what I'm yeah, look. Or, okay. Know, ER is emergency room. I'm looking. I'm just seeing but if they like ever did it, it or not. Because like the normal logo. Yeah, you're right. But I'm seeing if there was other, if there was ever a logo where they put the dots, but maybe not. Either way. Let's look at the images. Let's see here. Either way, that show went on too long. It eventually started sucking. Uh, and they really didn't give a shit about the medical stuff anymore. It was just like all character stuff. So that's where that's exactly where Grey's Anatomy is. It's the shitty part mm-hmm. of ER. Yeah. Um, and like they, they give people the way out. They're like, hey, your character has done this unforgivable thing. You should be fucking gone next season. Oh, look, you fucking found a way to redeem yourself Oh, until the next time you fuck up. And then we're going to go back and we're going to get hung up on that thing. And you did. And, the whole thing and they, 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 they just started at least what I just saw. Uh, maybe they resolved it. I don't know. I don't give a shit. They just started the whole trans debate, uh, between a couple of characters. Of course. So two characters have a kid together. The kid has son that is a boy. His long, curly, blonde hair is now saying, no, mommy, I'm a girl. And and the dad's <laughs> like, well, he's a girl now. It's fine. And then the mom's like, really? I don't think uh, we should be doing this. And then he's like, no, we're just going to, we're just going to, we're not going to really affirm it or anything. We're just going to go along with it. Let him explore things. And then they go to a, a counselor. <sighs> they, they go to like a marriage counselor about it because I guess they're, right. I guess they're a couple. I missed if they got married or not. I don't care. But either way, they want to go to a counselor. And then the counselor is 100% just affirming. It's like, no, no, you just go along with what the kid says. Oh, fine. of course. Yeah. It's just like, no, no, it's fine. It's like, it's not even like let him explore. They're just like, it's a three-year-old, by the way. Um, if that, you know, and it's just like. Yes, but, because a three-year-old is totally capable of making but, adult life changing, affirming decisions. Like but it that. wasn't even like a mom, I want surgery. It was just, I feel like a, I'm a girl today, you know, whatever. But then they're like, we're going to let him put on dresses and all this other stuff. We'll let him explore if he's a girl or not. And I'm just like it's like i knew they were going to do this at some point this this is why these shows nowadays are just complete bullshit i mean they're they're at least well they have to they have to stay with relevant topics somehow to introduce it usually they do things like this with temporary characters like a patient comes in right like they they had the whole whole they did have a whole um not necessarily abortion debate but they had a whole life of the mother versus the baby debate because it was a very complicated situation where the dad is dying of cancer. The mother is pregnant, but it's like the last of his sperm was made to finally get this kid going. And she's already got a complicated pregnancy to begin with. So they're like, 
will can we can we uh make the baby get born prematurely so that the dad can at least see his child before he dies yeah and then spoilers shit goes wrong and the mom dies and they prematurely oh. deliver the baby and then oh, they God. literally they literally the rush they literally rush the baby to the dad because she's like dead dead she's like fucking dead uh yeah. And they rush it to the dad who's like not even conscious. Like he's, his, <laughs> he's like on literally his last fucking legs. Oh, um, God. He's, he's like Who dying. He's like totally dying of cancer. And, you know, yeah. shit happens. Don't get me wrong. But like, you know, they open up his uh, gown or whatever and they put the baby on his skin and stuff like that, which I mean, still a touching moment. But then, yeah. of course, he dies minutes later. So now we have a baby with no fucking parents and born early. So it's like, okay, what the fuck? <laughs> it's like, yeah, it's like, how, do you, how do you solve this problem? I don't know. Yeah, and this, all of this is going on while to the, the other, orphanage with yeah. you. Well, no, and all of this is going on while the other couple is having their debate on whether or not they each side dep- wants their child to be reaffirmed as whatever they believe they are on the day yeah, or right. uh, reinforced reality. Yeah. The, yeah. So it's like they're ha- they're having a whole uh, ideological discussion. <laughs> on top of an extreme case of medical problems. So it's just like, and in the meantime, everything else is falling down around their heads. I just fucking hate it. I fucking hate the show yeah, so yeah. much. It sounds like always, I'm invested, but I'm it's hate always invested. The, yeah. It's always the, <laughs> now, mind you, this is Kara's favorite show of literally all time. She's mm-hmm. watched every single season multiple times. Uh-huh. And she can't like when it comes time for that, it's like, it's like me. Like when I come on here with you guys and stuff is, is I'm shut off. Don't bother me. This yes. is going on. Yes. If you need me, you better write a note or text me or something. Just don't bother me <laughs> while this is happening. Exactly. Unless it's an emergency. She's the yeah. same way with that shit, dude. Yeah. She everything shuts off. That's same, where she's same in the thing, room. Same thing with, with the wifey there. No. So, but I fucking hate it. And like I think I hate it. Like I, I did appreciate the early seasons. Like when it was still kind of a normal show before yeah. the extreme. Dreamy McSteamy. Yeah, exactly. The McDreamy, McSteamy, all that nonsense. And by the way, there's a new guy. He's an actor who's been around for a long time. He was in Underworld. He was Michael in Underworld. Um, so mm-hmm. he came on as a visiting doctor who could only do this one thing. So therefore, he's super important. We can't let him leave. And of course, he's Meredith's new love interest. Is like, have you noticed you fall in love with dudes who all look the fucking same? Yeah. She's <laughs> like, Jesus he's Christ. McSteamy 2.0? <laughs> at least. At very least. <laughs> And like, uh, and I'm sorry, and I'm sorry, I will, and, and say, you can say this to Kara and, and see how she reacts. I think the show should have ended when Derek died, period. I don't even know who Derek is. It's her, it was McSteamy or McDreamy, McSteamy? whichever, which McDreamy. Okay. It's the, uh, what's his name? Patrick. Yeah. Him. Stuart Dempsey. So, was Patrick Dempsey? Dem- not Dempsey. No, <laughs> that's, that's step by step. Um, whatever. It's somebody. Him. Pat, yes, him. So, oh, no, I think Dempsey's the last name. I don't think it's Patrick. Either way, doesn't matter. So, I think the show should have ended when Derek died. That should have been the end of it. So, and that was like season ten or Five? eleven. Yeah, like it was early. <laughs> no, it wasn't. That's the problem. It's like it was like season ten when he died. Um, oh, the other one died early. Yeah, the other uh, one died before that in the plane one. crash yeah. situation. With okay. all, that's still stupid. They went all lost on that. Either way, know, she made me watch some episode like where people died in like a, a bombing at the hospital or some shit. Yeah, that, that happened too. Really, ER did that uh, better. It should have should have beat with yeah. with Grey's yeah. Anatomy. It's going to be the South Park and Simpsons analogy. Who did it? E- Who did ER, it better? Er did it. Oh yeah, Er. Yeah, it's er definitely did everything. It, but better. But it's capital yeah. letters, so you would say ER. No, you just say er. You'd say it with an exclamation. You'd There's no other R's. Force. There's yeah. no other R's, yeah. Ricky. The, you, but you'd say er. So you it's, wouldn't say it's, er because there's no period it's separating. E, it's, in ER it's er squiggly line. Sound. It's er squiggly no. line. Nope, it's just because er. it has the squiggly line under it in the logo. No, the periods a, are inferred. The inferred no, periods. Not. Because you can't infer means, a period. Get the fuck out of here. I don't know what y'all because, teach your kids in Canada. But I do. Because we are in the emergency periods, room. Periods are not. For Pete's sake. <laughs> Even nope, on the her. show, it's like ER. Nope. It's E period R period because it stands for emergency room. It is an that's acronym. It, it has to have periods. Nope. Yes, it just says, but that's why the says, er. periods go to emergency room. In Anywhere you see ER, it has periods. It's a, in just between. a yeah. logo. But, but Mike, you know, Mike, you come from a country that doesn't allow apostrophes on signs. So, oh, yeah, punctu- so, yeah. punc- so punctuation yeah. is, uh, is no. not really all strong suit. 
Only in Quebec. Yeah, only yeah, <laughs> fuck it. Only. But I, I think, periods. but I, I think, I think when it comes to Grey's Anatomy, it the thing should be er did it or er did it, depending on yeah, if you're, it. but depending no, on whether you're an it. er tart or not. Um, uh, er did it. Yeah. Either way, I couldn't it, care. All it, these it, medical you gotta dramas make sure, are pretty much the I, same. I don't know. I might. Okay, so now, now we have. Okay, so now we gotta extend the show name. So it is. It's getting longer. It, it, it is, <laughs> it so to speak. Is, I turned off my my camera because oh, nobody shit. wants to see man titties. Uh, hyphenated. Hyphenated. Now it's hyphen. Period, periods are inferred. Parentheses. <laughs> no, 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 no. No, I have a better title. I have a much better title oh, for that. Not, not periods are inferred. It's like I'll infer your period. Mm, ah, that's the title. Go, go. That's that's no, part of the title. Bro, bro, I'm yeah, going to infer yeah. your period. Rolling up over black Cadillac, high heel boots and a sexy body full of tats. Baby's battle 